the new trailer for the really, really interesting looking film, The Big Short. You've got guys like Steve Carell, uh, Christian Bale, Ryan Gosling. Who else was in there? Brad Pitt. Um, I mean, this this might be the most stacked, like A-list caliber acting talent-wise film of the year. The first trailer finally dropped today, brought to us by a very surprising director, Adam McKay. Mm -hmm. Schnapp, you just watched the trailer for it. What did you think about the new trailer for The Big Short? I loved it. I was like, who's not in it? It's like everybody just poured into this movie. And, uh, you know, it's a it's great because Adam McKay is a very, he's very politically minded. If you're pals with him on Facebook, you're like, you know, it's usually not comedy we're talking about on Facebook. It's serious issues. So it's really nice to see him tackling something like this, which is definitely quite serious. It's about how the banking uh, industry almost took us down, you know, and we're still dealing with it. We're still dealing with a lot of shady stuff going on in America. And this is, it's really cool to see someone tackling this. It's a very serious story and I'm very interested in seeing it. The trailer itself was really well put together. It had a little bit of a Goodfellas vibe to me. So I'm really excited about it. But there is going to be a lot of comedy in it. And and you can see that even yes. from the trailer, there are some laughs you get and you don't oh, expect yeah. it when you're talking about the housing market crashing. Yes. I rent an apartment. So even me, it's still it, it was such a big thing that happened and everybody experiencing that when it went down it's like how did this happen how did we let it get this far who discovered that this was going to be a thing did anybody know about this in advance and kind of get their stuff together and get out before it happened and yeah we are going to get all of that and it says based on a true story this stuff actually happened like with any based on a true story film we talked about this last week i think somebody wrote in it's like do you guys get upset when they change the facts about a true story to make it more entertaining. I hope they stick to the facts in here because the facts alone are worth making a movie about. Plus, this trailer continues the Mission Impossible 5 theme of having a Led Zeppelin tune in your trailer. <laughs> it's never a bad idea. Um, I... I have mixed feelings about the trailer, to be honest. First of all, I'm I'm really looking forward to the movie. I thought Steve Carell in the trailer looked amazing because whereas everybody else comes across as strong and cocky, Steve Carell, there's that one scene in the trailer where he's like on the stage talking like fraud. It, it always everything goes south when you do stuff like this, and the the camera goes. He goes, when did we forget that? And he looks honestly perplexed mm -hmm. about that. He doesn't look like the strong mo that we are used to seeing in all the characters in these types of movies. I really like seeing that. Christian Bale looked really awesome as well. Totally different look for Brad Pitt than we've ever seen before. I think Ryan Gosling was Ryan Gosling in it. The one thing though that didn't work for me in the trailer, and I have a feeling the movie's not going to do this. But for whatever reason, they did it in the trailer. It just kept hitting you over the head with like every five seconds, there was a beat of, banks are corrupt. This is fraud. Fraud. Evil. Naughty, naughty. Bad on them. These are bad people. Like it was like they just kept, do they hit you over the head with it. It felt like every five or 10 seconds, like it was like a cadence. Beat them over the head with banks are bad. Banks are bad. Banks are bad. And banks may be bad. I'm just saying that you don't hit me over the head with it every five seconds. And it, it felt a little too on the nose for a trailer. There's no... There was no sense of subtlety to the trailer, and so that turned me off a bit from the trailer. I have a feeling, though, that the movie itself isn't going to feel that way. I just feel like they just put all of it in the trailer. I, I don't know. Did you? Do you guys think I'm off my rocker for that? I mean, the, the, the trailer moved quickly, and so my, my big issue with the trailer was that it was hard to tell wh who am I rooting for. Is anybody in here bad? Is anybody? Right. Am I going to walk yeah. into the theater and hate that person? I couldn't. It looked like everybody was kind of on the same team. Ryan Gosling, I'm a little concerned about what his character is, but my overwhelming take was that, well, this movie looks good. The haircuts are all atrocious, and <laughs> then it comes out in Christmas, and it's a perfect counter-programming to something like Star Wars, where you go see Star Wars, and if you can't see Star Wars, you get something totally different which is i think it'll do well yeah i think uh christian bale reminded me of weird al yankovic <laughs> he looked like <laughs> the white nerdy weird al yankovic version um but uh you know i the the bank thing that them going back and back to that back and forth to that it, the way the trailer at least to me felt like it felt like oh these guys are aware of this this insider banking thing and they're going to shut it down and as you went forward with the trailer then you realize i don't know if that's how what's going to happen or not but then you see oh they're all in on maybe like trying to scoop money and mm -hmm. you know get in on it before it all cr everything crashes so they're also doing bad things so who's the who's the bad guy who's not the bad guy so i don't think it's that black and white in this case gosling smelling a pretty big check that's that's <laughs> Shot yeah, alone. Check. Yes. That was one of the best shots in the trailer because it does exactly what you're suggesting. It shows multiple dimensions to these to these guys that yeah maybe they're uncovering something, but 
Maybe some of them decide, I don't know the true story right. of, of these guys. So maybe some they uncovered this terrible thing. They're trying to shut it down. But at the same time, hey, maybe I might as well make some money off it. Well, since I know about it, I mean, I, I don't know. And that's the good part about this trailer that makes me really look forward to the movie. Never take the time to smell the check, kids. Just get that bank <laughs> deposited it. as Cash fast that as you check. can. Get your yeah. app in front of it, take a picture of it, deposit <laughs> it, and walk we away. We all know what paper smells like. Just cash that check. <laughs>